In this video, I'm gonna be analyzing the 2019 French Open Finals. Before the game starts, you can see how Jonathan is getting confidence by jumping slightly and shouting, and Chen Long is being very calm and collective. Both of these ways are great ways to increase your focus during the game. First rally, we see them both being patient, but Jonathan is slightly adding more pressure to Chen Long. Both of them have been playing very evenly, so to get an advantage, you have to keep your consistency until someone makes an error. Another way to get an advantage is to focus on your shot quality. And as you can see, this is what Jonathan did on this rally. He did the exact same thing the next rally. So by being present in the moment, it opens up all these amazing shots that you are capable of doing. This rally shows how both players are having a consistent mindset. They both pressure each other around and are both being calm at the same time. And they basically stay like this until Jonathan starts to add more pressure, making his shots harder to return. But it's not about being able to be consistent, it's about how long you can stay consistent. And you can see Jonathan starting to make unforced errors. He makes an unforced error the next rally as well, while Chen Long stays calm. You can tell Jonathan is starting to slightly lose his patience. Since the game is almost over, Jonathan is starting to focus on catching up rather than just playing the game with a consistent mindset. And this is why he makes more unforced errors. Chen Long was the player who was able to maintain his consistent mindset longer. Even though they were very even, he was the one who made the least amount of errors. In a very close game, a slight edge makes the difference between winning and losing. Second game we see right away Chen Long being more aggressive and adding pressure. He is taking advantage of Jonathan's mental state since he made a lot of unforced errors last game. You can clearly see how much he ups the pace during this rally. He feels completely comfortable doing it since he's been playing very calmly. Even though Jonathan is not playing bad at all, Chen Long is still too much for him since he's in a superior mental state. Jonathan just hasn't been able to stay as calm as Chen Long. And when you are not in a relaxed state of mind, you begin to rush and rushing leads to unforced errors. This is how Chen Long won and had the advantage during both games. He was the player who was relaxed the longest without rushing so much. Unfortunately for Jonathan, he let his mind distract him by focusing too much on catching up and trying to win the game. What's really cool though, it's that both of these players are aware of the influence the mindset has during a game. In this interview after the semifinals, Chen Long said this. <laughs> Yeah, in fact, I didn't think too much. I just uh, try my best to uh, to to work out my best performance. And during the semifinals, Jonathan's coach was basically telling him to not worry about anything and just focus on playing the game. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to see more awesome badminton videos. I'll see you in the next one.